Everyone who had Bitcoin, the famous cryptocurrency, seems to be stuck in a rut while the stock market soars. Travis Kling, founder and chief investment officer of Ikigai Asset and Management, recently delved into this very topic. He compared Bitcoin's performance to the Nasdaq, which has surged 16% since April 19th, following a low induced by market trepidations about rate cuts. The Bitcoin has surprisingly underperformed, remaining relatively flat. Play numerously pointed out, BTC is trading pretty crappily relative to macro. Uh, Kling's analysis started with the dynamics of U.S. spot Bitcoin ETFs. From May 13th, the market witnessed 19 consecutive days of robust ETF inflows, totaling approximately $4 billion. However, these substantial inflows only resulted in a 17% increase in Bitcoin's price. This underwhelming response suggests underlying issues in market structure or investor sentiment that might be damping expected bullish response to inflow surges. And moreover, recent ETF outflows have coincided with a 7% drop Bitcoin's price over a similar period. Klink speculates about external factors affecting Bitcoin's price, such as potential government sales of Bitcoin confiscated during the Silk Road operation. He also highlighted the influence of Ethereum on Bitcoin's market dynamics. As for Ethereum, despite its influence on Bitcoin, ETH itself faces challenges. The anticipation surrounding spot Ethereum ETFs has not translated into sustained positive price action. The broader altcoin of the market is also suffering, with many tokens significantly off their highs and struggling to find a footing. Uh, in conclusion, Kling's analysis suggests a cryptocurrency market at a critical juncture, facing internal competition and macroeconomic mismatches that can define its trajectory in the coming months. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time, 